Hi everyone, hope you've been well. Thank you for joining me today. Um, today I'm going to be planning in my Hobonichi Weeks um, planner. Um, it's been a while since I've been planning in this, um, recording this on a video to plan, um, but life has just been so busy and I just had not had the time to record. I've still been planning in my planner itself, I just haven't had the time to really record it all on video. Um, but today I'm going to finally um try and get some filming done to try and get something uploaded into the channel um so i ho hope everyone's been well so far you know hope you've all had a lovely easter so far um so the week i'm planning in my planner is the following week today is a friday it's friday the 14th which is my sister-in-law's birthday today um but basically i'm filming the week from planning sorry for the week from 17th to the 23rd of april right now i'm using the emote fine liner if i could get it to zoom in let's go and zoom in there we go i'm using the emote fine liner um to draw in my lines for this week it's 0 0.4 i have a collection of these which um come in various colours and um, I try and use a different colour for each week just so I use them up and it's just nice to have a little differentiation. This is like a sort of like a bluey green colour you see it in camera but it's like a bluey green kind of colour like a teal almost. Um, so I'm just marking down the lines at the moment for the week. Sorry if you can hear my neighbours in the background. They're just in the garden and this is the only space I have to film and probably the only time whilst my husband is still in the house before he gets ready to go work and whilst there's some decent lighting coming in. <laughs> okay, so that's my Greek set up. So I've drawn a line here. The first line I've drawn down here is um, this column itself is for important dates, so for birthdays, appointments. This little column here that I draw in is to mark down my husband's working hours and this column here is uh, shop related stuff so whether it's um, uh, to do with orders and whatnot um, and like you know prepping and stuff and then here I'm going to do my um, usual setup so first on the top is happy trackers let me just bring this in a little so you can see what I'm doing. So here are my habit trackers. And for this I do use a fountain pen. Let's see, so let's do days of the week. list okay, and then I'll draw another dashed line here just to separate that from the rest and then next is my weekly tasks these are the tasks that I do in week in week out um, the only problem is because every day is a different day with the boys at home I never know when I can get them done so I tend to write it here rather than in here and then get upset that I didn't do it on the day and I leave these this small space of things that I know that I definitely do on the day. Um, so there's four of these.
more tasks this week. So the last two weeks have been Easter break. So the boys have been off from school, just enjoying their holiday. Um, so they haven't had a book from school to read over the holidays. They tend to take them away from them um, during the holidays and then during the week when they're back at school, then they give them a book at least uh, once a week so that um, they can bring home and then read for the, the week and whatnot. So this is just a, a little um, reading log to make sure that I try and read the school book that they bring home. They have their own books and they I do read them to them every night, but I usually try and get them to pick what book they want to read and not necessarily they want to read the book that um, the school gives them. So I write these down so I try and make effort to try and get them to read the school books at least because it's something different from what they have at home. Okay, so that's my weekly tasks. This will more or less always stay the same unless I've added something new in. Or, you know, if the boys are off school, then I'll usually take away their reading log because they haven't got a book from school. And then at the bottom, let's see, is there anything I need to do this week? Ah, yeah. This week. I've got a couple of points down. And then... to prepare party bags the following week it's actually my son's birthday he's turning five and um his school allows him to bring party bags i know some schools don't allow you to bring party bags no more um but his school allows him to bring party bags so i've already started buying some bits and bobs and they are here but not everything is here and i don't want to get them started unless everything's here so I'm going to try and get the party bags done sometime next week so it's done as his birthday falls on a Wednesday so I need to make sure that that's done at the end of the week because next week I'm going to be baking some cookies as well for his um, classmates goodie bags let's see their birthday is Saturday Sunday Monday oh. yeah, do someone so Tuesday Oh great, I've just smudged it. Right, so it's okay, we can live with this. Right, what else do we need to do? Sleep train Caden. Okay, so my youngest, he currently um, co-sleeps with me on the bed, but he's getting quite big now, so I'm slowly trying to transition him to the cot and whatnot. Um, yeah, I think, I think that's it for this week. Oh, actually, I've got payday going on. Let's get, um, let's get a flag. Let's see what colour we want to use. Maybe one of the pastels. Look at my tweezers. more prepared than this. Okay, one of my tweezers. Okay. Right. Um, what colours? If we're going for blue, let's go for blue colour flag. There we go. And Paydays on that day. Find the payday sticker.
payday. Yep. Yeah. So we've got payday sticky here. Use that. Okay, and then let's see. Let's leave a couple more points for this week. Just in case if I need to fulfill anything. And then let's close this off and then just write the shopping list maybe. Let's see. No, this is to do. Where's the to buy? Here we go. Oops. Let's pop this over here somewhere. Let's see my to buy. Let's do this one. Maybe like this as well. I'm going to list my shopping list of what I need to make for the cookies. Probably go buy it somewhere to coming towards the weekend so I have it so I can bake it on Tuesday, maybe after work. And then I could pack it and then that will be it for the bags. Let's see what I'm supposed to buy. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 items. 1, 2, 3. So just save me time for her to flip through the back of this. Self-raising, am I? I think I've run out. Self-raising. Flower. This is the list for stuff that I need to make for the cookies. And, um, stuff that I need to make Isaac's birthday cake as well. I think you sure have. Um, what was it? Milk. We always need milk anyway. It's fine. But I'll write it down. I need cake board. And then I'll just leave that last one out. Just in case. Um, okay. I think that's everything this week. Let's see. Yeah, that's everything this week. Um, yeah. So I haven't got my husband's, um, working schedule yet so I don't know what else he's going to be doing next week so I can't fill that in but this is everything that um that's going to be the setup for now for next week um thank you again for joining with me and hope you have a lovely day bye